Bros, this is we the play the Brent Patrick of YouTube. Welcome back to Super Smash Bros Ultimate World of Light Adventure Mode. And I'm recording this on the very same day that I did all those other uh, episodes leading up to defeating um Bowser. Some Bowser. Giga Bowser. That's what it was. So I've got Bowser playable now. And I've made it back to, I guess, the main part of the map. Why don't we take a look at how much of the map we did? Hmm, not a lot. So this time, I'm going this way to Marth. And we'll just see what lies over there. So let me set this up. And we're off. We're going to recruit Marth, and we're going to see what lies beyond the fog this time. Any other paths that I haven't taken, or that I did not bother finishing, I will take care of in a different video. Right now, I'm just determined to get as far as I can, as fast as I can. There we go. March joins the battle! We got more skill spears, and it's off to a brand new location. Where will we end up? Well, we gotta beat this spear first. Claret Arlen! What is that music? I've never heard that one before. Um, let's see. What are the conditions? Enemy special move is increased power. Enemy favors side special reinforcements will appear during the battle. Oh, hail from the past. Yeah, I haven't heard that music at enough time for me to memorize how it sounds by just the first few notes. Not one of my most favorite Castlevania themes, honestly. But that's just my opinion. And I'm entitled to my opinion, so me, 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 me. Anyways, <laughs> got that spirit. Mel Sonic's to 50. I swear if he doesn't evolve into Mel Overlord, I'm gonna be upset, like that whole pincer thing. But, we'll figure that out later. So this looks like a typical path. This looks like a fence. I'm so glad I went this way. Okay, there's another boot here. Um, Let's go over here and beat Don Bungo from Yoshi's Story. So the enemy is going to be giant, there's going to be some other things, we're going to use this adorable Yon Yoshi amiibo, because why not? Uh, increased move speed after a little while, and reduced move speed after a while, I guess. This is like the fourth mid-boss that you can encounter in Yoshi's story. Now in case you don't know how Yoshi's story works... Um, there's branching paths, I guess. Not necessarily branching, but it's like, the more of the happy hearts you get, I can't remember exactly what they're called, the more levels you can access in the next world. You can only do one level per world, per play, play, play through. You got four choices. And the fourth choice is always the hardest. But you won't be able to access the fourth choice unless you get all three of the happy hearts in a level. One day I'm going to play the game, so you'll get to see what I mean when that time comes. Don Bongo is mine, though. So that's cool. I be in with you on Yoshi. Yays. So community question. 
on a scale of 1 to 10, how excited are you to play the new Yoshi game coming out on the Switch? I keep forgetting what it's called. Anyways, I'll be going against Charging Chalk, who favors dash attacks. So, this shouldn't be too hard. <laughs> Again, this shouldn't be too hard. Being. Shouldn't being the big word there. But there's been a couple of battles where I thought that I could get through it easily, and I end up flubbing it. So that doesn't really help. Alright, one down. Got three more. I might change the mark soon. Give everyone a chance to shine. And if there's anyone I forgot to play as, let me know in the comments. I'm gonna be unlocking a lot of characters, so I'm probably not gonna remember every person I played or didn't play as. 74 characters for crying out loud. Can you blame me? I wouldn't blame me. So there we go. Does my word really mean anything? Uh, wow, this is going all over the place. But there is a fight over there, so I'm going to take on Farfetch! Who has lipstick! No, I'm not King. He comes with lips. Uh? Okay, Don Bongo. If you feel we can win, I'll choose you. Even though you have no sub, no places where we can have sub characters. All right. See if I can get Falco to. Let go of that flower. Oh, wait. Oh, I think Don Bongo's ability... Never mind. I was going to say, maybe it makes me receive less damage from the flower. I wasn't exactly weaving the lipstick, technically. But we've accrued Farfetch. And are going to another new place. We are making tracks. It's probably because now that I have more abilities and I'm stronger. Oh, it's a boat. <laughs> um, okay. Well, first off, I don't think Bowser would go great on that teeny little boat. So, I'll pick someone else. Um, I guess we'll go with Mars, since he hasn't gotten any time to shine. So, into the boat, Mars. If you knew how to pilot a boat, you could cross the lake. Well, rip that dream, then. We're going over here to fight Brittany and Ace. Oh, no. Uh, it's a time bow. The enemy becomes more powerful after eating. Oh my gosh, I remember facing this one. I could never win. Well, rip. Rip, 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 rip. I'm gonna die. I'm not gonna make it. I'll try. Heck, if I had that... Wait, I do. Wait a minute. I messed up. Oh, well, I'll just go for it. So, this character powers up after eating, so at least I picked an ability where I can gravitate the food toward me and gain that power for myself. So maybe I can still win? Maybe? I just know I had difficulty with this particular spirit, and I cannot honestly remember beating it at all. To, uh, not looking good for me, is my point. But, she is already at, you know what, 
I think I'll win. Never mind. I got it. I guess I just didn't have good spirits with me when I went after Brittany on the spirit board. Which that might have been off screen. Oh yeah, and the pincer could help. I didn't even realize that I decided to pick pincer. That they picked pincer for me, so. There's that. Overpowered pincer that doesn't turn into mega pincer. Oh. Oh, this is going to be another one of those areas. Oh, wait, Kamek did that. Okay, thank you, Kamek, thank you. I'm going to face off against all of them So if I hadn't, so if I didn't have Kamek with me, I wouldn't have been able to activate that. Got it. Because there was something that activated while I was at Bowser's quote-unquote castle. The hub world for the castle, anyways. And I wasn't sure what it was, but that makes sense. And it also makes sense that all the more would be in a overgrown garden like this. Ooh, look at those skill spears! I know I have enough now. I know I have enough now, so let's get a new skill. Go to the skill tree. I've got 99. Hmm, I don't know if it goes past 99, but we're definitely gonna use... We're definitely getting this one. So, we got that. Our B specials are now powered up. Not bad. Oh, I can activate the shop from here. Or I can warp to the shop? How's that work? Do I warp to it or can I just stay in this one place? Welcome, come on in! We got a skill spear. Eh. Actually, I could buy anything here. It will fix the stage? Is that really what that does? Hmm. Let's just buy the skill spear for right now. And we'll work on some of the other stuff later. Like I said, this isn't my... Um... This is a temporary file I'm using. Alright, good. I stayed in the one place. Ooh, treasure chest. What we got? <laughs> More skill spears. Perfect. Um, might as well see what else I can level up. Let's see what we got here. Landing lag. Uh, breaking ability. Hmm. Let's go with recovery items this time. This one will be 50 and will be Fire Explosion Resist. That would be a good one to have. I'm feeling good. I'm feeling pretty good about my decisions. So next we'll face off against the Eridescent Glint Beetle. It's obviously from Pikmin. I just don't know anything about it. It's a time stamina bow and the enemy tends to avoid conflict. Great. Well, I'll be using Yon Yoshi, I guess. <laughs> I don't know if that's too OP or not, but that's, I guess, the overall plan now. Oh, it's gold. Oh my gosh. Look at that golden turtle. He's awesome. He's also doing a very good job avoiding me. I don't... I think I should have picked Mark. It's not exactly that fast. There we go. Oh, there we go. I could still do this. There we go. If you had more HP, I think it would have been harder. Ooh, sticky floor immunity. Very nice. Not the nicest I could get, but still nice. Especially if it's one of those Omega stages. 
Uh, I feel like I'm just going to go ring around the Rosie. So we're going to take on Master Belt. Sure. The floor is sticky. How ironic. And you have reduced defense after a little while. Well, um, uh, I think I'm just going to take lipstick because this is another one of those battlefield stages where as long as you're not on the bomb platform, you don't have to deal with it. So, that said, I'm going to stick up here. <laughs> I said stick, I'm losing. I mean, I'm not losing that badly, but... This Wario is being kind of a bit of a minute. Uh-oh. My defense is down. And I got whacked by a shell. Uh, let's try that again. Yes, continue. I'm pretty sure I can beat this. I just kind of stumbled a little bit. That's all. Yeah, the muck. Not to be confused with the Pokemon. The defense is down! Are you kidding? Don't do that, Marth. Please don't do that. Oh. Okay. Lost my lips item. At least I could do that. Ah, I tried. Oh, my defense is down again. And he ate something food. Still got the upper hand, though. There we go. Master Belch is mine! Not sure how often I'll use him, though. We'll leave it to luck of draw. The luck of the draw. We'll leave it to luck. And over here, we've got a character. I have a feeling I just took a shortcut, but there's something over there I could have gone to. But we'll leave that for a different day. We'll take on Rabbit Kong, featuring Bunny Donkey Kong, where the enemy's punches and elbow strikes have increased power. Of course they do. Of course they do. Alright, you monkey. I'm gonna take you down. And then I'm gonna recruit whoever's over there and we'll use him in the next episode. Him or her. Or it. Because uh, it could be Rob. But it probably isn't. Rob's probably gonna be in a different location. We'll just have to see. I love that I have to do this twice. I'm sure there's going to be a Rabbit Peach um, spirit. I mean, why wouldn't there be a Rabbit Peach spirit? She's more popular than Rabbit Mario. And that's saying something. Rabbit Kong is mine. And now it's time to see... Who we're going to recruit. Then I gotta figure out which way I'm gonna go. It's Pac-Man! Didn't quite expect that. Win the battle to awaken the fighter. Can't be any more simple than that. So we'll use Pac-Man in the next episode. After we defeat his creepy, creepy face. Why does it feel like I'm going slower? Is that just me? 
I feel like Martha's moving slow. I don't remember him moving that slow. I got a bunch of skill spears. I don't know if I'm gonna use them yet. I guess I could see how many I have. Oh, something's happening. A boss! It's gonna be another boss area! Which is located... There, of course. What is there? It looks sort of familiar. I'm not 100% sure. Definitely not Legend of Zelda related. Well, we'll find out more in the next episode. Yeah, I'm gonna save my points. So, until that episode, and until my next videos, this has been We The Play. I got nothing left to say, so I hope you enjoy your day. Catch you later.